Hello everybody, it's December and yep, uh, that's a frog. That's one of those frogs that kind of lives in my lives in my rain gutter growing system. All right, so yeah, it's December. It's 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 the winter time and what's going on? Well, that sunflower, I got to enjoy some of the yellowness of it for a little bit. You see I've got my hoop house up. It's leaning, so I've got to fix that. I've uh, got some, I believe it's some little U brackets that I haven't. And I just, it wasn't leaning before, so I guess I just got to come back in and re-drill those in. But, oh well, we'll get up underneath that here in a moment. Now, here is my couple, my last year, my two-year starter little greenhouse I used to keep inside. This is now an outside thing. Uh, and we've got some lettuce growing in it. Uh, I think it's just like regular old fancy lettuce. It doesn't look too much like like romaine. And here, this is what I had my cast net in and I decided to go ahead and uh, repurpose it. Now it, uh, <laughs> this is a Great Lakes head lettuce, I believe. <laughs> Sometimes I forget what I plant where. It's got some bugs in there but this thing it's been very humid inside of it uh, and has been really wonderful as far as uh, plant growth uh, I may take these plants and uh, let them grow kill that mosquito for a second there we go mosquito down uh, I may take that out and put it over here in my aquaponic system and I might yeah, I'm probably going to turn into a hydroponic system, at least in, for the meanwhile. On to my uh, rain gutter grow system. Hello to you, Mr. Larry Hall. Uh, we can see that the lettuce that I've planted is doing wonderful. This lettuce coming on kind of slow, but you know who cares? It's uh, still coming on. I got some new growth going on there. I decided to put one of my broccoli plants out here but it's got some brown and other leaves and my little repurposed uh, cranberry grape uh, greenhouse <laughs> not much else is going on in the growth system now underneath the hoop house here uh, one thing about you know this type of plastic is that it wears out uh, a huge hole ripped up over there it had some mildew growth uh, but you know, I power washed it off as best as I could. Uh, my lettuce that I planted is growing fairly nicely. And I'm not quite sure. None of my lettuce has ever done the grocery market head for me yet. And I don't know why. <laughs> I hope somebody else does. Uh, but my broccoli plants over here seem to be doing nicely i can't wait till they grow up uh, so i can get some broccoli off of them and then there's those sweet red bell pepper plants which are dying if not dead and i'm just we'll wait and see if any of these other ones turn red i'm not going to eat that one red one right there because it's kind of shriveling i'm just kind of you know leaving it there <sighs> bunch of onions right there still trying to figure out what to do what kind of ingredients I need to use for that as far as, as far as this you know all the fish have died so what I was thinking is go to my local aquaponic hydroponic store and get some of the nutrients put the nutrients in there so it would fill up use it for my NFT and the ebb and flow, the flood and drain uh, grow bed here just to see if that would produce. And I've been searching online for different ways of um, making a, a grow lights here and what to use. And I believe the man named Praxis has a good idea that I can use. And I kind of want to do more PVC work, possibly take that out, um, make PVC there, make a an well, NFT out of it, and an NFT coming this way, and then again coming this way, a shorter one, and then dumping into 
that so I can expand my my growth capabilities with the NFT method as well as the flood and drain and then back into here and if that be the case then I can take out my swirl filter because I won't need it uh, and so because I don't have the fish in here so I may do that uh, we'll come up with the ideas and I'll let you know in the future videos other than that I'll take it easy get growing yeah, we'll see you later.